Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. In this beginner friendly tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add multiple collections to a page in Shopify and it does not require any coding. All you will need to do is go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on products. After selecting products, you are going to tap on collections and I'm going to be showing you how to create a collection. All you'll need to do is tap on create collection in the top right hand corner. Then from there, you can add your collection name. So let's say for example, I would like to call this collection everything. Then you're going to scroll down and you have two options how you can select the products that you would like to add to a collection. You can either automate it and this basically means that you can add products to this collection based on the product tag, the price, or the weight. So you can select that if you want, or you can tap on manual. I normally select manual, so I would tap on manual right there, then tap on save in the top right hand corner. Then you are going to stay on the same page and you are going to scroll back down and you are going to tap right where you see browse. After selecting browse, you can select the product or products that you would like to add to a particular collection. You are going to tap on add and you would just keep on repeating that until you have created all of the collections that you want. Once you have created the collections, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option once more and you are going to select online store. After selecting online store, you are going to tap on pages. Once you have tapped on pages, you are going to go over to the top right hand corner and you are going to tap on add page. And this is going to be the page that you will be displaying your collections on. So you can name the page whatever you want. So for example, I will name this page test. Then we are going to tap on save in the top right hand corner. Once your page has been saved, all I want you to do now, if you would like that page to be displayed on the main menu option at the top of your Shopify navigation bar, you could tap on navigation from the left hand menu option. Then you would select main menu. After selecting main menu, you could simply scroll down, tap on add menu item. Then from there, you could type in the name of the page once more. Then tap on search or paste a link tap on pages, then tap on the page name, then tap on add in the bottom right hand corner. Then you can tap on the six dots right beside the page name and you could move it to wherever you want. So let's say I would want it to be right below home. Then I'm going to tap on save in the top right hand corner. Once the changes have been saved, you're going to go over to the left hand menu option once more. And from there, you're going to tap on online store once more. After you have selected online store, I want you to tap on customize beside the theme that you're using. After selecting customize, you're going to be redirected to the editor page. Once on the editor page at the top where you see home page, you're going to tap right there and you're going to select pages. And from there, you're going to select default page. After you have selected default page, you will be redirected to the page that you have created. And now all I want you to do is go over to the left hand menu option and right where you see add section, you're going to tap right there and you're going to tap on collection list. After you have tapped on collection list, it will be added to the page. Then you're going to simply tap on each collection. So you're going to tap on it. Then from the left hand menu option, you're going to see select collection. You're going to tap right there and you can start adding the collections that you would like to be displayed on the page. So I'll tap right here once more, then tap on select collection. And I'm going to be adding this collection right here. Then I can tap on select collection once more, then tap right here. And I'm going to be displaying this collection right here as you can see there. After each one has been added, as you can see there. So let me add something else right here instead of the home one. So let's say, for example, I were to add a ring. 
after you have selected that and you're finished all you'll need to do is tap on select at the bottom of the page after you have selected each one so that is why you're not seeing them saved so i need to tap on select collection then once i've selected it i'm going to tap on select at the bottom of the page for it to stay then tap on this one right here tap on select collection and then i'm going to be adding this one and i'll tap on select at the bottom of the page after you have done that you are going to tap on save in the top right hand corner now that the changes have been saved if we were to go back so we are going to tap on exit in the top left hand corner then we are going to tap on view your online store once you have selected view your online store you can tap on the page name from the top navigation bar and once on the page, you'll see a list of all your collections as you can see right there. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.